Hello everybody, it's Red Panda Gamer here for another food review. Last time we reviewed the quesarito, the burrito wrapped in a quesadilla. This is kind of gross, but it's all right. Today we're going back to Pizza Hut. Last time we got the stone baked flatbread pizza. And when I went on Pizza Hut's website, as I always do, I was greeted by a brand new, well, it's not new, they brought it back. It is the Cheesy Bite Pizza. Maybe, are you okay? It seemed like it scared you. You should be scared. This shit's gross. This is the Cheesy Bite Pizza. It's $11 with one topping. And as you can see, it is lovingly embraced by cheese-filled breadsticks. Kind of an idea of our time. You know, we have the cotton gin, you have the wheel, and then you have the Cheesy Bite Pizza. Um, clearly, we are in the presence of greatness. Or so you'd think! Maybe, I know I freaked you out, I'm sorry, but you gotta calm down. You know what, grab the camera. We need a close-up of this, right? All right, so, well, you gotta watch, you gotta look to see if it's in focus. I guarantee it's, it's, it's in not. Focus. I don't believe you. It's in focus. All right, so you see the picture, yeah. right? Yeah. Disgusting. Also, the other new thing that Pizza Hut's apparently doing is they're doing this katana-style slices, and it seems like it's an attempt at marketing about Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the awful Michael Bay film based on one of my favorite cartoons. I'm just gonna go ahead and show you how... I'm a pretty big fan of Ninja Turtles. I'm a pretty big fan of Ninja Turtles. I have the entire cartoon series. I also have all the movies. And they fucked it up! But I bought the pizza anyway, so I guess I'm part of the problem. Anyway, so what we have here is, it's cut in fours, like I said, katana style, because four turtles pizza. And each one of the corners has its own like weird, it looks like a combo, like a homemade like combo, like the, you know what I'm talking about, right, Mike, combos? Yes, sir. Only 90s kids remember. Um, they also did include like a sauce, Dip, a dipper, which I didn't expect because they're cheap bastards. But you know, for $11, this is a lot of food, which I can't complain about. I mean, I can, and I have been, but I won't. And um, I guess the best way to do this is just to kind of sample the breadstick pieces, and then I'll go ahead and sample the pizza. So, uh, so yeah. All right, that's pretty pathetic. So it's like the stuffed crust pizza, but it's worse. Like the crust on the stuffed crust pizza from Pizza Hut. This is like lower than Bosco stick quality. Is Bosco sticks like a well-known thing? Like, will other people know what I'm talking about when I say Bosco oh, yeah, stick? Totally, yeah. That's not like just a Midwest thing. No, that's like a middle school, high school thing. Okay, these are worse than Bosco sticks. And I mean that. I don't use insults like that very lightly um so yeah the breadsticks by themselves aren't that great but this is a pizza i didn't order breadsticks you know i didn't order breadsticks mike i didn't order breadsticks i ordered a big ew there's a bug on me that's no good we ordered a big pizza like look at this shit who's your favorite ninja turtle mike, uh, mike wrong that's the obvious choice. Donatello is the superior Ninja Turtle. He's smart and he's goofy. He wears a purple bandana. And in the new movie, or no, in the show, he's got like that weird like chipped tooth thing. It doesn't matter. Adds personality. So the pizza. As you'd expect, is Pizza Hut pizza. It's not great. It's not the worst. It's better than Little Caesars but pretty much worse than everything else. Except Domino's. Or Pop... It's not that bad compared to, like, fast food pizza. But I imagine the way that God intended me to eat this God-forsaken mess of awful Italian bullshit is to, like, curl the pizza over like a burrito or a quesarito. <laughs> it's canon. Is roll it up and just take a big old bite. Mmm, but not really. This is like... 
I don't even know what to say. I'm not surprised. I'm mostly just surprised at how ugly this thing is. There's a little bit of, like, garlic. Like, this is supposed to be, like, a garlic breadstick. I don't taste it. And... I mean... I don't know what I was expecting. You know? I didn't expect it to be good. And it's not that good. And I mean, I appreciate the concept of, like, sharing... Like, why would you order breadsticks and pizza when you could just have a breadstick pizza? Because the breadstick pizza's shit! And I don't, like... Here's the thing. Hey, Mike, do you want a breadstick? Yeah. Okay, come have one. Have a breadstick. Just take uh. take a breadstick. This motherfucker just put his hands all over my pizza. I offered him a breadstick, he sullied up my pizza, he's gonna give me his cat allergies. Wow. Mike's allergic to yeah, cats, yeah, yeah. and now I'm allergic to cats. I love my cat. Where's my cat? Maybe. Maybe. Where is she? Oh, she's over there watching hey, us. Hey, baby. Go get her. Oh. Uh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, right? It's not that good. It's just, it's not even like good bread. It's not even a good breadstick. It's just super generic, no flavor. But I mean, I gotta eat it. I paid f like thirteen dollars to have it shipped to my house. Maybe. How's it going, Kitty? Oh, you're scaring her. That's just let her down. It's okay. You're a little baby. This is my cat, maybe. You can't. What the I don't. Fuck, Mike? Hey. What are you doing? Hey. You want to smell the pizza? She's eaten Pizza Hut pizza before. She is not in. Come here. If you want to sniff it. Okay. She's not in. She ate steak from Taco Bell. She's not interested in this pizza. I don't blame you. I'm not really either. Um, if I was to score this pizza on a scale of 1 to 10. You know, like, I have to give it credit for being inventive, and I have to give them credit for the stupid advertising of M M Michael Bay's Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Turtles in Time. Like, it's cut in four pieces. Cool. But this piece is garbage. I gave it a five out of ten. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like the video, comment down below if you eat this garbage. And be sure to suggest what I should do next time. And also don't forget to tell me I'm an idiot for disliking fast food. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks, Mike, for not really helping much and for fingering up my pizza and giving me cat allergies. I'll see you guys next time. So long.